Welcome to the Hydraulic Press Channel. Hi. I'm Laura. I'm Hanna. And today we are going to see how much damage can hydraulic hoses take before they explode. Mm. And I don't mean over pressure. We have done that already. They can take about four times the rated pressure. But today's video is about staying on the rated pressure and then damaging the hoses with different methods like grinding, fire. I think we can gonna up with like we are pretty good on breaking things, yeah. so I, I think we can damage these. And also, how good are these uh, protective sleeves? Can I put, I can put the it. protective devices yeah. on my hose? <laughs> you are laughing, this is like serious. Yeah, matter. this is a real, yeah, re really serious science channel. Yeah, yeah there it went. Yeah. yeah, if you have problems when protecting your hose, it's always okay to ask your friend to help out. The setup is the same as usual. We have hose attached to the cylinder, fill up the cylinder with water, put the piston here, add 40 tons stir, hose goes boom, yeah. and that's it. Okay, this is now full of water. We have the hose here, and first damage method is uh, operation with the grinder. Of course, you're not going to grind your hoses, but it might like rub against something or something might happen. I think we can do quite much. Mm -hmm. I think I think it's no point like doing like really very 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 little. I think that's good. There is like small amount of steel missing, but not not like anything terrible yet. Not any loose wires or a like couple loose wires here, but not much. Let's let's try with this. Okay, here it goes. Uh oh. Two attacks. Four times. Yeah, it, uh -oh. now it's leaking. Uh oh. I also slightly overdid it. It was 44 tons, so <laughs> it was a bit, bit, bit too much. Okay, but the hose is. Hose is good, so let's grind it more. Yeah. You have all the lights on because of the high speed, so it's really, really hot. I would 100% not use this hose anymore. Okay, that was about 400 bars, and we didn't go. I have gone through the first steel layer completely, and pretty deep into the second one. It's a pretty large hole. It's not a pinhole at all. It's quite large. Okay, that was about 250 bars. So it was really, really durable still. Almost like full pressure rating or like operating pressure. Usually hydraulics run around maximum of 300 bars. So pretty good. And the water comes out almost or pretty much around speed of sound. It was quite hard to estimate from the high speed, but it comes out fast and it would cut skin easily. Uh, okay, what is the net? I think the fire is going to be mm -hmm. next. It would be interesting. Okay, now we have the burnt hose. I'm not sure how this could happen in the real world. Maybe if you are welding or using like cutting torch next to the hoses. Sounds like really stupid idea, but the engine like we mechanics, I'm mechanic by trade. We can be sometimes pretty stupid. So if you have the stupidest mechanic in the world. Yeah, 
Yeah, it turns out that the hydraulic hoses don't like fire. <laughs> At least not that much. Yeah, we are going to replace the hose and go back to the mechanical damages. <laughs> okay, now we are going to simulate impact damage, sharp impact. And I hit it quite hard. You can feel that it's like dented. The steel wires are like this. So does it affect that when we apply the pressure or will it just like pump back up and be completely okay? Let's find out. So siinä oli about 350. Okay, I think this is much tougher than we thought. So I'm going to I'm going to chop it like real good. Whoops, there was a Hmm. 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 Okay. I decide that I'm going to hit this with a sledgehammer. No, nyt on su hyvä. Okay. Sledgehammer damaged hose with a sock. Oh, my God! I'm going to get Okay, it basically just fixed the holes. It's round again. And we want to see what this does on normal pressure. So I'm going to make a like cut with the grinder. I think it's going to fail. That was maybe 100 bars. I think it works actually really well yeah. because it, it, it clearly comes through, but it's not sharp. Yeah. I think we uh, captured it better here. Okay. There is hardly any damage on the sock, and I think it, I think it works. Yeah, yeah. It like breaks up the fine set into like mist that goes like everywhere. Mm. So I wouldn't like bet that it's going to save you if you hold the hose, but then you are like so stupid. But if, if like hose explodes here, sock is here and you are here, I'm pretty sure that you are okay. So, and these are like really cheap. I would definitely use these. Yeah, but that was our hose episode. If you like this, go check out our old, 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 older hose episodes also they have more energetic explosions and please let us know what we should do next and that is all for today thank you for watching and have a nice day